Dun, dun, dun. So what's up people? I am back. You're gonna do the setup now. The setup aka Just the setup. The second case in Vice. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't matter. All this is on replay because uh, uh I made a mistake in early in the recordings. It's because uh I b I didn't really I, I recorded it but uh at the same time I had to cut up because I had to go, I had to leave. And you know. I didn't know that I can't restart the whole case. I can't I didn't know I can do that. I can I didn't know I can't I can do that. I didn't know I can do that so I just pretty much, pretty much I just did a replay. I just replayed and there it go. From there on I just kept going recording that way. Just set up. You like the fight game, Phelps? I did a little boxing in the Marines. I found it a pretty humbling experience. Hmm. Phelps is a good person. Make you a sandwich, buddy. Corned beef and egg salad, 12 cents. Bologna and ham and cheese, 10. It's strictly a mugged game. You'll like this fight, though. A plucky lime is about to take a beating from an up-and-coming Negro. You sound pretty sure about the result. I ought to be. I got 50 bucks on the black kid. Let's get a ringside seat. This talking about a throw game. I thought the game against uh. <laughs> I'm his trainer. Interesting attitude to have towards a victorious athlete. Victorious? We had an arrangement. We had a goddamn arrangement! That limey bastard was paid to take a nap. He reneged. And you were out of pocket? Damn right. Me and a couple of hundred other people. Stand aside. <laughs> he squeezed out the window. I'll put an APB out on him. Why? Why would we do that? He won the fight fair and square. To prevent him from getting clipped. He was paid to flop. There was big money riding on this So are fight. we here because you lost money, or because we're investigating a prize fighting racket? Very funny. Look around and see what you can find. <laughs> Which is Hammond's locker? Over by the pin board, second from the end. Yes, Seems irrelevant. Yeah, I saw the newspaper right here. Alright, uh, alienist Fort Fontaine, working selflessly in firm. Which one is this one? You look trouble. Oh uh, yeah, if you, uh, like I said, if you kept up with the newspaper people, you realize what's the story between everybody in the background, including what happened after the war. Actually, what happened after the war, I guess you can't see it, but, uh, pretty much, uh, Kelso, we all remember Kelso. And uh, Phelps, we'll, so we'll see Kelso soon. But uh, uh, they got another friend uh, that took some of the that drugs that we saw in the first case of Vice, and uh, uh, that's from the Marine, and that they took that drugs pretty much. And yeah. He took the. Then they stole. They stole it. It's the morphine. Yeah. 
He stole the morphine, and he stole uh, some of his uh, buddy, marine buddy, stole the morphine and stuff. What's a bunch of names and odds? You're not the only one who likes a flutter, Roy. <laughs> There's nothing in there. Telephone time, I guess. Come away. Got shaking. It's glitching so bad. Use the phone and get out of here. Eh, glitch. I love when the game glitches. You better find that cocksucker and you bring him to me. I feel bad too, Mick dear. He guaranteed me he would take the flop. I guarantee that you will be fish food if you don't bring me. Roy, you out of pocket too? Mickey, seems that way. Don't worry about it. My boys are out looking for him. Well, you'd better call them off. This is a police matter now. If anything happens to Hammond, I'll testify that you made threats against him. <laughs> Who's the Greyhound? He's a frisky one, isn't he? Cole Phelps? Mickey Cohen. I know who he is, Roy. I, uh, met his brother-in-law. Oh my god. He's flexing muscle now. I think hey, wait, wait, go back around. pretty scared back there. Ah, oh, they're gone. Phone is outside up. Yeah, the point. Operator, give me R and I. Putting you through now. Putting you through now. Cole Phelps, badge 1247. How can I help, Detective? How can I help, Detective? I need an address for the following phone number. AL345. AL345. The address for the phone number is. Nine one 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 one. Elmar, sixty two ninety four Leland Way, Hollywood. Thank you. All right. You know the place? Flop house. Quarter and nine. Oh my God! I'm getting that one right there. I'm glad. You seem to have a pretty cozy relationship with Cohen and Stampanato. Do I know the hint of reprimand in your tone, Detective? Talking to gangsters comes with the turf. You should try out Mickey's place. He's got a haberdasher's up on Sunset. See if he can get you out of those old. Oh my God! What the hell? It's a front for his illegal activities. Can't stop talking. It is that, but he does carry some very sharp suits. I said it, people. I am the worst driver in this If it's game. okay with you, I'll stick with Brooks Brothers. Oh, I went to take the wrong turn. Supposed to be never in right there. Are you crazy? No, I'm fine a little bit, but you know. Just a little bit, dude. A little, a little bit, my dude. I like that music, man. That's like old school right there, people. Classic. People, kids don't listen to that nowadays. They listen to Rack Rack City music. You know, Rack Rack City. I'm faded, faded. You know, it sounds like that. I mean, I'm tired of. I'm, it, it's okay. Yeah, Kinda cheap for a bit, LAPD. but you know. We're making for inquiries into the whereabouts music, no of lyrics. Albert Hammond. No one here by that name. You sure? Sure, I'm sure. This isn't the sort of place where people use their real names. Take a look at the register if you don't believe me. <laughs> really? Okay, so look for prominent Tommies. That's your narrow Blake, it down. Jimmy Cagney, Hedy, Hedy Lamar, John Calfield. 
Wait, what are we looking for again? Hmm. Real happiness is when you marry a girl for love and you find out later. Jimmy Carr. How does it say Jimmy Carter? Marilyn Monroe. Bob Hope. Humpy Hoggart. That's a chess show. That's it. It's not tapping in the same thing. Winston Churchill. <laughs> Very patriotic Englishman is staying in room 207. Marilyn Monroe. Staying in 204. Even at a flop house, Adley can't get out from the shadow. The 202? I swear, this town is going straight to hell. I read about it. Wait, where do we go then? Uh, you got a problem now? No, God. Yeah, two, 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 right? Or two or four? Hey, Marilyn Monroe. You see Marilyn Monroe, two or one. So, what's which? Is, oh, two or seven. Okay. I thought it says two or two. Mistake. Let's go two or one. <laughs> yeah, two or seven. Oh, that's just right there. Looks like he's had a broad up here. Instigate. Adrian Black's product of choice. Seems like a lifetime ago. Candy has expensive taste. Albert has his work cut out for him. Who's Candy? Candy Edwards. The lady who filled out this coupon. I guess a fighter has plenty of time on his hands between bouts. Especially nowadays. I just do like a two month, during one month train. Does Albert have somebody special? I didn't see anyone in his corner in the fight. Alright. He must hey, be a flies. You know, I hope he makes it. That crooked son of a bitch, no chance. I don't know why is he running away. Why don't you just go to the police or something, man? Right? Circumstantial. Oh, he just used that, I'm guessing. So 
So we're not done with the hotel anymore. Mm. No, we didn't. Oh wait, there's a box right there. I saved a whole year for that car. Mm, can't click it. Is there anything here that I'm missing? Oh well, we're out of here. I swear, this town is going straight to hell. I'm waiting, Roy. Not right now. What are you we're looking for, Roy? There's nothing there. Well, there's nothing here, Roy. I'm um, but smacky. Something that I missed that I need to flip on the paper. There's nothing there. There's nothing there. It's just chocolates. What the hell am I missing? Give me a second, people. To say, but uh, I'm guess, but Roy won't leave. That's why. I have to talk Keep to talking. people. Here. Someday you'll say something Roy. Oh my god, damn. It's saving. For some reason, it's saving. You're behind the wheel. Fine, where are we headed? I don't know. I don't know if I miss a clue or anything, but uh... So, you boxed in the Marines? We all did. Standard training. I can't imagine you ever played dirty. The only prize for taking a fall was a thousand push-ups. Well, you don't... you never take for a fall. That's like in a night... that's like in basketball. People flop and you don't do that. That's just... You don't flop in street ball. You know, when you're playing in the street, you don't flop. That's the last thing you do. And you don't call for a foul when you're playing basketball. 
Up in the black top. You get hit, you get hit. It's your fault for sh uh, driving straight to a person. <clears throat> we need to know which LAPD, ma'am. We're looking for Candy Edwards. Apartment 7. You take the outside stairs by the parking lot and turn left at the top. You friends of the Italian guy? Italian guy? Yeah. Sleazy type? Gave his name as Carlo. I didn't like the look of him, but Candy has some funny friends. Thanks. Mm. This Candy broad must be as sweet as she sounds. All these gentlemen callers. One, two, three, four. Give it up, bitch. He's gone. Sounds like we're missing all the fun. Get in fighting. there, fell. <laughs> oh my god, this is Pata. Mm. Mm. I'm a boxer, boy. This isn't gonna end well for you. Bro. Oh, sucker. Uh, sucker punch. How cold, but breathing. Give her a minute, take a look around. Give me your stuff. Gagging you. Nasty weapon. All the Italians carry them. A real man uses his fists or a gun. A real man does not use a gun for maybe a fist, but not a gun. Kind of dumb ass logic is that. Carlo here seems to have the same friends as Hammond. What are the odds on the mall being bookmakers? Let's see. Let's see if this will wake him up. I just want to see. One, two, one, two, one, two, one, two. Okay, stop messing with him. Okay, that's what that's messed up. Shouldn't be messing with a knocked up person. Hey, get off her. What are she doing? She's leaving town. You don't say. Scania sails from New York. Single ticket, one way. I guess there isn't a lot for Albert, Ohio. Take a seat, Miss Edwards. We have some questions for you to answer. Look, I haven't done anything wrong. Ever? I find that pretty hard to believe. Mm, me too. Can you answer some questions now, Miss Edwards? Sure, I've had worse. I'll shake it off. We're trying to track down Albert Hammond. We have reason to believe he might be in danger. Do you know where he is? No, I don't. I'm over Albert. I haven't seen him. You're lying, Candy. You were in his hotel room. He came back after the fight and you weren't there. What happened? You can't prove that I was in the room. Mm. No, but this one. How do you think we found you, Candy? You wrote your name and address on a coupon. Look, Albert was supposed to take a fall. We were all supposed to make a little money out of him. But Albert got too goddamn stubborn. Said his pride was all he had left. So I told him, shove it. Let's see his pride keep him warm at night. So you walked out before the fight? Yes, I did. What's the problem? I didn't take anything. Do the names Harry, Mervyn, or Ray mean anything to you? Could be anybody. How the hell would I know? You lying again. See, I see. Lies. Nice. Tell me the truth. You How the hell would I know? B word.
Albert wrote his winnings down on a notepad in the hotel room. We found the odds in his lock. Who has the betting slips? That son of a bitch, Albert. Everyone thought he was dumb, including me. But he beat them all. You're leaving town, Miss Edwards? Yes, I'm going straight home. Yeah. Albert is going home by boat as soon as he collects his winnings. I know you're going to meet him. Albert is going to collect nothing. He'll be lucky if he can get out of town in one piece. How will you fare any better? They already believe you're in on it. Hell, I know you're in on it. You can think what you want, Buster. I'll take my chances. I got a few errands to run, and then I say adios to this dump. Do you want to press charges against our Carol? Just get him out of here. That's all I want. Get out, Carlo, you hump. And get rid of that pig sticker. You ever pull that thing on me, I'll shoot you like a dog. That bitch knows where Hammond is. She knows where my money's gone. My money too, tough guy. Glitchy. I'll handle this. Glitchy. I'm telling you, this game. I remember the first time I played this game. This game had no glitch. It was clean. But right now, it's glitchier than a chicken fry. Bad people are looking to hurt candy, and yet she's not heading straight for the train station. I smell a payoff. I say stake her out, see where she goes. Follow time. Tail is broad. Don't let her get away, but don't get spotted. I'll bring up the car behind you. I mean hidden in plain sight by going incognito. How many times can you go incognito? You just walk with the newspaper in front of you. And you don't see anything. Solid snake up in this. No, B. Ah, she saw me. I see. Ah, uh, boo. I can do this. I can do this. I'm good at stealth. Okay, I got it. Then she's slow too. How could you see not see us right there? Look. Look at this. We're right there behind a the newspaper. It's not like if we put the newspaper on us, we'll be invisible. No, we're not invisible. Icon will flash if you are slipping too far behind. Right there, she's yellow for. She's right there for. Get closer. Go ahead, go meet her. Hey. Risk losing the trail. She 
not that far, she's just right there. Weird with that man. Come on, Paul. Why did I get never run before? Somebody walking me. Walking me. Walking. Oh my god! How can she see me? Reels! I'll be like... I was like, I'll be like, damn! Then I'll be like, damn! And I'll be like, wow! She see me, look at this. How you go into Nero, you just sit there. Like nothing is that wrong. It's not going incognito. Oh, it's just going standing there looking at something. Pretend to be looking at something. Yeah. It's very incognito of us to uh What the hell is Roy doing? Are we doing this? Oh well. Oh, yeah. Just gonna cross the road while people are just driving by. So, thanks. Where the hell is she going? She can hop at me. Scared the hell out of me. Got a man going to wall. Suspicious. Going after a lady. Oh my god, this is that is not cool right there.
Surprise, surprise. A blonde woman just came in here. She went out the back way. Said she was being watched. How much did she collect? $3,600. She claimed me out. On the Hammond Kid Galahad fight? You got it. I'm not complaining. We all made a lot of money on that one. Huge plunge on Galahad, and then Hammond knocks the bum out. So she collected the money and went out through the back door? Nope. She made a phone call over there, wrote something on a notepad, and then left. Gonna do the trick again. What are you doing? <laughs> An old intelligence trick from the Marines. Yep. Hollywood. We know where she's headed. Let's get moving. Right, let me go. Over right here. That's that cop. You go guest. Drive. You drive. I need to go over the case notes. Do we know where we're going? Hammond backed himself to win. And Candy is picking up the winnings. Smart play. The question is, is Candy collecting on Albert's behalf, or is she cheating him too? Car 11 K11 King, further to your request, Bumso Fraud has three known bookmakers operating out of storefronts in the Hollywood area. Thrifty Liquor, 6106 Santa Monica, the Examiner Drugstore, and a Max Sturitz at 1658 North Cherokee. KGP Elkman. Let me play. Get in there, dum dum. Detective Phelps and Earl, LAPD. Relax, Cole. You just have a blonde in here, Mervin. Sure did. I'm just about to close up. She took me to the cleaners. Four thousand clams and change. How long ago did you leave? Maybe five minutes. Called the cab. Asked for a number. I told her there was a card over there by the phone. Dude, just following her up, bro. Is it phone? Yellow cap. We need to get after her fast. Operator, message for KGPL. Can you connect me to the Yellow Cab Company, Hollywood 2187, please? Who's that thing? This is Detective Phelps, LAPD. You dispatched a cab to 1487 Ivar Avenue, Hollywood. Hey, darling, you going to sleep without kissing, Mom? Huh? Sorry about yes, that, people. Yes, sir, one round for the pool. Do you have the number of that cab? You smell so good. Thanks. Would you want to change? Yeah, that's fine. Go change one. Go change. Go, do uh, 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 um, Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Go, go get some pajamas. What? I said to me, I can sleep tomorrow. Huh? I can't sleep tomorrow. Sorry about that, people. I'm a little bit. Come busting in this room. I need to really get a lock on this You know the way. Room. You can drive. All right, where to? Salmon's drugstore. 
How much are we here already? How many are we here already? What do you think? Do you have any idea who Ray is? Sugar Ray. Not now, Mervyn. Cole doesn't have much of a sense of humor at the best of times. Ray runs a shop up on North Cherokee Avenue, just south of Hollywood Boulevard. So we are done here. You can drive. Where are we going? This broad's planning on cleaning out every bookmaker in town. Hammond needed to make sure he was getting a bigger payday than if he'd taken the flop. Never trust the limeys, especially where a fight's concerned. A mistake you can't seem to stop making. Boy, so bad, dude. That's why he does what you did. Just the cab out an hour, hour people. She's hour. not in the car. Don't get too close. She must be inside. I wasn't driving. I wasn't driving. We're on the move again, Cole. After her. Don't lose that cab. Hammond is over the hill. It's a punching bag for the up-and-comers. She knows goddamn place. I think he knows. I think he worked out the place isn't L.A. He's punchy. His brain's going to mush. Winston Churchill? Give me a break. Churchill is a fighter, boy. Hammond didn't just scribble down the first name he could think of. Go. Yeah, go. Hey. Y'all need to get out of here. Now would be a bad time to forget how to drive. Yeah, just park right in the middle of the road. Sorry, people, I was looking at my text, that's why. Damn it, we got him. He's off, quick. Hey, that's how I do my turns, huh? No? Get out of my way. Oops. I do, but I don't. Dun, 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 dun. Oh. Okay. That's not a good way to trail someone. Yeah, this taxi driver can't drive. Yeah. God damn it. Suspect discovery. How did she discover me? I'm like driving perfect. I get it in text and driving it's not a good thing, especially in video games. <laughs> okay. We're on the move again, Cole. After her. Don't lose that cab. Hammond is over the hill. It's a punching bag for the up and comers. She knows goddamn place. I think he knows. I think he worked out the place isn't L.A. He's punchy. His brain's going to mush. Winston Churchill? Give me a break. Churchill is a fighter, boy. Hammond didn't just scribble down the first name he could think of. Oh. Don't drive lousy, don't drive bad. Oh, the advice I can give you. That's probably the reason he caught me because I'm driving like a maniac. Being this sure he was gonna win. I run out of gas.
Don't be doing that again. Turn, 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 turn. Dun, 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 dun. I don't, I don't want to crash. That's way too close. That bitch has given me what I'm owed. That's all I know. Nobody owes you anything. Now that the only reason we're going after him, after him, because he might get killed. And we have a case that will go from home. Why are we here anyway? We're vice. Anyway, don't we do? Don't we should do what we have to do. Boxing fights. No. Just by you shooting. Pull over. He's heading inside. Almost got out. That close to Greyhound. I think I just saw Hammond. I'll tail him. You get in there and stay with Ken. Make sure you don't let her see you. Uh, oh shit. Incognito. Wrinkled was not one of the <laughs> things I wanted seen me. to be when I grew up. Let's find out about the game. Let's see about to get blasted. BOW! Are you lifted up? That's that cop. Seems like a decent guy. Oh my god, no! She got blasted. What happened? Boy! Call an ambulance. <laughs> Just try and sit still, Candy. Who shot you? Was it Albert? If you didn't talk, let her talk. I have a patrolman searching the depot. The chief's putting together a manhunt for Hammond. He got the money, right? Looks like it. A tough bird, our limey friend. Using his girlfriend as the bag woman and then getting greedy over the split. He won't make it out of town. That's how you see it? I told you that cocksucker was a crook. Better rest again? Thirty two caliber, one shot fired. So what now? The theater, I guess. We don't have much else to go on. Let's go. The theater. Can you drive to this one? Do we know where we're going? Poor girl. She didn't deserve that. Poor girl. Half the precinct aren't taking a vacation this year because of her. You need to leave town a lot quicker than that if you decide to screw over Mickey C. Remember, this is Lenore, Los Angeles. Well, the mafia wasn't hit, and you know the mob wasn't as strong as they are in New York and in the East Coast, you know, Chicago and stuff like that, even in Vegas, but. You know, they, they are still around in, you know, like Hollywood. This seems like a long shot, aren't they all? Car 11 King, Car 11 King, come in. Car 11 King, message from the coroner. The car 
cause of death was a knife wound. Repeat, a knife wound. The revolver appears to have belonged to the victim. Son of a bitch. He stabbed her. I thought you said real men use their fists, not guns. That guinea cocksucker. You think he got the money too? Come on, Roy. We're bringing this whole tragedy to its conclusion. Yeah, but to go blasting up in here, like CJ from San Andreas. Yeah, rock star. He says CJ from San Andreas. Why'd you kill us, Carlos? Oh, I remember this one. She was collecting the money for you. Make me clear. She stole them basically. She was running out on me. Then you were gonna let her? No, I let her collect. I set her up. Just like she set me up. Just like my manager set me up. Everyone wanted me to take a dive. Everyone wanted me to take a short money. It's for the best. Kid. You were washed up, kid. You couldn't climb, and you were too brave to sink. You were going nowhere. Maybe, but I had heart. I was a Royal Marine, Carlo. If I lost a fight, it wasn't for lack of trying, and it wasn't for lack of courage. I didn't have much, but I had that. I did it for you, and that's how you repay me! You did it for yourself, so did little boy. You did it and made a quick buck, and Candy did it and make the dream come true. Blah, blah, blah! I've got the money, all I need to do is get rid of you. It's gonna be a shame, kid, but that's business. Can somebody shoot Roy? How would anybody shoot Roy? What would happen? We've heard enough, Arcaro. Put down your weapon. Yeah, I'll have you shoot. Ah, making a big mistake. Arcaro. Okay, I guess you can't shoot your own teammate. Ah. You're covered, pal. Throw out the guns. Oh, yes. Give me some goddamn cover. There's one beside you. Come on, Cole. How was it that? Blast them. Find the cover. Oh my god, my hat! Yeah, in the face! Shot everybody up! Without a hat. It's time to come out now, Hammond. Put the gun down, Roy. That son of a bitch owes me a lot of money. <laughs> Catch. Escania sails from New York, Hammond. Be on the next train and don't ever come back. Why? Because I was a Marine and I once lacked courage. Everyone deserves a second chance. Now beat it. <laughs> Royce pissed off. Royce hella pissed. Fuck you! That English prick is getting away with my money, Phelps! Donnelly and the Homicide Squad send their best, Phelps. They're more than pleased that you wrapped up the Edwards killing. They're a little mystified about the motive. You have any ideas on that? Uh, crime of passion, sir. Uh, looks like some sort of love triangle between the manager, the fighter, and uh, uh, his girlfriend. No sign of the scrapper? No, sir. Looks like he left town after the fight. Okay. It's homicide's problem now. Good work, gentlemen. <laughs> Roy got screwed. He can't say anything because if he says something, then... You know. Yeah. I thought we missed, like, I don't know, clues. So anyway... Man, vehicle damage, heavy damage. Got it. Okay, I am done, people. I will see you guys next time in this recording of Lenur. Ilinur. So, uh, I got one more case for uh, Vice. And I think that would be the last. So, I will see you guys next time here in Ilinur.